guys, welcome to my channel Halloween Happy, where Halloween is more than just once a year. I know that the video has been introed like this for the past few videos that you've probably seen, but I promise it's not the same clip. future Sam here. So in today's video, I have another haul for you guys. Disclaimer, disclaimer. This one, like the last haul video that you saw, these are items that I did purchase last year, but I still wanted to share them with you guys. Filmed this video during winter when I was trying to get through everything for my office. As you know, if you're a familiar shopper at TJ Maxx and all of those sister stores, you kind of see the same items every year at every store. It's like always the same, the same thing. Not that that's a bad thing because sometimes you can get the item that you skipped out on last year because you said, oh Sam, I don't need it. You don't need that. You don't need another one. And then you get home and it's Sunday morning and you're putting up your decor and you're like, I think I needed that. I hope you guys can still enjoy the Halloween-ness, get some Halloween inspo, get some ideas, maybe think about what you're gonna be shopping for and browsing for to add to your home decor collection. Okay, back to the actual haul video. Follow me on Instagram, check out my Facebook page, all the social media links are listed down below. If you haven't checked out my Cozy Essentials video, I'll link it right up here. These items are just from random places such as TJ Maxx, Home Goods, your usual Halloween go-tos. Found these at Marshalls. I saw a few other people pick these up. I shared them on my stories because I was like, get these shower curtains if you want a spooky bathroom. So easy. These are from In Vogue. As you can see, it's like a Ouija board theme. You have palmistry going on. I liked this because it is brighter. The one that I have up now, I have a few that I need to rotate through, but I like this one because it's bright. And as you guys know, I mentioned before, I'm trying to brighten up my space. There's not a lot of windows in this apartment. There's not. Love this one. I think I might switch this like now. All these cute little ghosts on it. So adorable. And this would go good. You could do any Halloween color scheme with this. You can do like Black and green would look great. Purple would look awesome. Moving along, if you have a kitchen table, kitchen space, buy a Halloween mat or two. Really add some Halloween-ness to it. Found these from Christmas Tree Shop. They are these, a wove, is it woven? Braided. <laughs> Found these braided placemats from Christmas Tree Shop. I have another set that I got a long time ago that are black that say trick or treat, I believe. But like I mentioned, trying to brighten things up, go for the brighter color Halloween things. You could use these on shelves, coffee tables. It doesn't just have to be a place mat on your kitchen table. I forgot this shower curtain. We have, oh, actually it's all cats. Yeah, just this little spooky cat shower curtain. Cats dressed up as Dracula, the mummy. What else do we have? Just pumpkins. This table runner from Kohl's, I believe. Just kidding. Found this at Christmas Tree Shop. This was $10. I have a lot of like just random higher tables that I've found over the years that you can put behind couches, like a couch table, if you know what I mean. I thought this would be good for it just to dress it up. Found this hanging broom from Target, I believe. Just from their dollar spot. Um, I know I had mentioned that I didn't buy that much from Target, um, we'll add this to that. Found these boo sprinkles. So we we bought a lot of like Halloween flavored syrups, like pumpkin, pumpkin cheesecake, just all sorts of things. And I think I got these because I wanted to make really good coffees with like whipped cream and like Halloween lattes and stuff like that. Speaking of like baking and cooking and all of that stuff, found one of the Dash Pancake makers, this is in the shape of the pumpkin. I totally forgot that I got this. Have a mini waffle maker from Dash that I used all the time. Who doesn't like pumpkin shaped pancakes? And it's a plus because it's orange too. So if you're going for that Halloween kitchen, fit right in. I did find this Salem sign. It says Broom Company. I thought in my head, it doesn't have anything you can hang it up by. But how cute would this be for a cheese board? That's what I bought it for. Like I wanna use it right now and put some cheese, some crackers, some grapes, some little jams on it. I think that'd be so cute. $5 just in the dollar, the Target dollar spot. Found these really cute hand towels. These are so cute. They're super plush too, you get two in each. This one is just a black 
with little orange witches and then the border of it you have cat faces outlined. This one it's just spider webbing which I thought was really fun. These I would definitely use in my bathroom. I feel like there's a difference between a kitchen towel and a bath towel. I decided to add these. I think I'll use them when I switch up my shower curtain. Since we're talking about hand towels I found these at the Christmas tree shop as well. If you're looking to dress up your kitchen just hanging halloween hand towels if you have a few out just add some spookiness to your area put these on the the stove the fridge but it just says home sweet haunted home the haunted house in front of the moon with all of the little bats and stars really cute don't remember where i got these from i got them with having valloween in mind pastel ghost which is great for valloween i want this in wallpaper i guess i found this at target so so much for saying i didn't really buy a lot from target i wanted to use it as like a floor mat like around the front door to put the shoes on and stuff but it doesn't have any kind of rubber backing so it does slide around super easy um, but as you can just see it just says we're really into Halloween I don't know what I'm gonna do with that clips from the Christmas tree shop and they're super cute you can use them for anything I was thinking I would use them in the kitchen for like bag chip clips bag chip chip bag clips yeah chip bag clips you know the classic Ray Dunn says witch's brew. This scent is caramel apple and it smells like my old Halloween parties. I think that's why I got it to be honest. It smells so good. It smells like my old life. Does that make sense? Moving along, these cute silicone spatulas. I have a few spatulas that are like jack-o'-lantern and skeleton theme. If you guys follow me on Instagram, sometimes when I cook, I will use any kind of spooky utensil because it makes everything fun. found these at Joann's and I think I got them on sale. They were originally $10. Let's get spooky spoon and then just a black spoon with a little spooky ghost. This is from Ray Dunn. I found this at TJ Maxx and this just says beware of me. So now she'll have a little spooky matching set. It's so cute. Jack Skellington cutting board and serving tray. I got this uh, thinking about like doing a cheese board and stuff. I don't know if I'll use it as a cutting board. There was another item that for all of you Nightmare Before Christmas lovers, uh, I'm sure you could Google just Nightmare Before Christmas like cutting board and serving tray. I don't have a lot of Nightmare Before Christmas stuff, but this is just so different. I feel like this was the fastest Halloween haul I've ever filmed in my life. That's gonna be it. Let me know what was your favorite item. If you guys want more Halloween happy, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and check out my Facebook page. All my social media links are listed down below. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video finds you having a Halloween happy kind of day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! I wish I, what's like a clever name that I could come up with? My hair's gonna look different. It's gonna be during the winter time. Not that you know that it's winter. Like blast from the past, but. But don't go anywhere. Please still watch the video. Uh, I can't think of anything. Yeah, okay. I can't think of anything. A disclaimer, even though probably even though some of them will probably be available. Um, 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 I'll see you in the future again, right?